I'm Garner James and this is Garner Cherry, my brother. Wait, what are we doing? We just pick some spinach today, but first we need to take this off. Alright, so Gardner James and Gardner Jerry right now, they're going to remove our raised bed cover. This is a pretty cool thing. We actually got this on Amazon, but it keeps bugs from eating the spinach. And next to the spinach, I'll actually show you we have some lettuce happening here. And I go down here, you can see that we have some friends that are already out here eating things. So that's why we have this cover. And this is actually the first time I have allowed them to actually remove the cover by themselves. So, yeah. So hopefully we'll do it. We pull up all the steaks. James, get that steak. Oh, well, okay, that's good. All right, just move it over there. And so it's pretty simple. That's good, James. Right there is good. So it's pretty simple. Um, each corner has a little hook, and we push it down. And so now we have all the spinach. Let's show, show them all our spinach that's growing. Yeah, we have quite a bit. And part of the reason why you want to really get out here and get your spinach, because once it starts getting warm, spinach starts to bolt and it'll go to seed and the shape of the spinach leaf will start to change. It'll get pointy. And how does the spinach taste when it gets all pointy, you guys? Do you remember? Mm -mm. Yeah, because they probably don't remember because we don't eat it when it's like that. It tastes pretty bitter. So guys, go ahead, grab one of these uh, red bowls. We love these little red bowls. And let's start harvesting some spinach. And I am not on the Facebook Live. I have been sick since Friday. And uh, my nose is pretty red. It kind of got that Rudolph the Red No Reindeer thing going on. So that's why you don't get to see my beautiful face today. But, you know, Jeremiah and, and James, they're handsome gardeners. So I thought I would show you their two gorgeous uh, faces today. And we're really excited about all this wonderful spinach for getting here. We just discovered we don't have any uh, salad dressing in our house. So we probably have to make some. Because uh, we do a mix of both. We make our own salad dressing, our vinaigrette. And then sometimes we just buy uh, some nice organic dressing. And I believe we have a couple of our dressing recipes on our website at GardnerChacole.com. But, I mean, there you have it. We have a lot of spinach. And spinach doesn't really take that long to grow. We put these seeds out a little over about a month ago. And, I mean, it's already uh, ready. And once we pull these leaves, it'll start growing again. Spinach is uh, a really great cool crop because once it gets hot, it gets really hard to maintain spinach because it does bolt and try to go to seed. And that's part of the reason why we're picking it today because the... Spinach is pretty big, and actually, we could have even picked it when the leaves were smaller. And um, Jerry and James, have you already been eating some spinach today? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. How did it taste? Pretty good. Pretty good. But, but I like the kale better. Yes, James likes the kale better. Actually, I'll show you the kale. Um, right now, we really just have baby kale, and that's what James had today. He had, I'll lift up the little bed for you to so see it. James had a couple of these pizzas, and did you just stuff some in your mouth? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, we're going to get back and uh, keep harvesting the rest of this spinach. So we can get it inside the house. And uh, thanks for watching our spinach harvest. And remember, anybody can be a gardener. All you have to do is get ready, get set, and, and grow. grow.